Hey everyone, Danny Webster for Pocketnow.com, and this is another episode of the Android Application Weekly in which we review 5 applications in 30 seconds each. So let's get to it! Vibe is a light and paid for application built in the Android market that allows you to set custom vibrations to your contact and you can also set it as a group of contacts. So here if I want to set a custom vibration to a contact, I'll just choose one of my contacts. So from here I can choose a standard vibration or I can also choose a premium. I can also set my own vibration by going to custom and create my custom vibration by touching on this little square here. So we'll just create a vibration and we can either play it back or we can also save it as that contact. You Send It is a free application available in the Android market that lets you send large files through email using the You Send It application. So here I can choose my big files folder and here I have some photos that are pretty big. So from up here I can add any one of my contacts, I can also input an email address who can read and write to this folder and who can read only and all I have to do is click on send and it will send it to their email address. From up here I can capture something from my camera, I can also record a video or choose my photo library. And now we'll begin uploading. Soundtracking is a free application that allows you to find music that you're currently playing on your Android device or you can also listen to music through the radio or another speaker source. So here I can also post them to my Facebook, LinkedIn or Twitter account. So if I want I can ID a song here, so we'll just play a song and let it ID. So when it's found the song, I can just do soundtrack this and I can post it to my Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn account. I can also do a music search if I want to search for an artist. No LED is a free application available on the Android market that allows you to set synthetic LED notifications if your device does not have a physical LED notification system or if you just want to have a different version. So here I can select all my settings that I want and I'll just click home and send myself an email. So now with my Android on a lock screen, you can see this little Gmail icon right here and it'll float around the screen letting me know that I have a new Gmail. Train Conductor is a paid for game available in the Android market, so the option of the game is to move these trains to each various tracks in which the number is located on the front of the train. And you can also stop the trains and to prevent a collision, so here we can uh, just continue playing this. Okay, so when we're getting close to the end of the level, so right here I have 27 trains that I've uh, positioned into the correct tracks. So when I get to 30, I'm able to unlock another location, and now I've unlocked that position, and now if I crash these trains here, if I crash two trains, I'll end up losing this level. So this has been another episode of the Android Application Weekly, and if you like our videos, make sure you give us a thumbs up, and also leave some comments down below. The name of this live wallpaper is called Water Rise, and there are two versions available on the Android market, a paid version and a light version, which has limited settings. To get the download information for all of these applications, just follow the link in the description directed to pocketnow.com where we've stored the QR codes and also the Android market links. Thanks for watching.